Hello there fellow summoners, Mad Dog HT here, and I'm just gonna do a quick video, nothing too crazy in this one, just kind of wrapping up the results of season 37, which ended a few weeks ago, and I'm just kind of finally getting around to getting a little bit caught up. Um, we finished in Masters number 18, it shows 8, but it's in the second bracket, we were 18 overall, which is um, exactly what we wanted to do that our goal is always to reach masters if we can get into the top 10 and all that stuff that's great but masters is always the goal a lot of solid um, rewards these are with the, the buffed uh, season rewards from alliance war what two seasons ago it's pretty decent we get these two um or i think this may be the first season where it was where it's buffed up more yeah, this is the first season. So we get two selectors. We get a bunch of rank four materials. We get a bunch of um, selectors as far as um, tier five. And then we did get a crystal for tier six. Um, I'm not gonna open that one right now. I'm just gonna kind of ho hold on to a bunch of those because they're irrelevant. Can't get enough to, to take anyone to rank five. And then congrats to uh, TCN. They went undefeated. Um, totally rocked it this season. They took number one. GT40 got knocked off the top spot. They took number two. And then JA number three. And here you can see the rest of the, the standings as far as uh, Masters top 10 goes. And then here's the next 10, 11 through 20. And you can see we, we landed number 18. Um, in our season, you know, it went pretty well. It, there had some up and downs. The end of the season got pretty scary and tight, and I'll just kind of show some of the matchups and um, exactly what happened. Um, I felt like our strength of schedule as far as who we faced was um, very, very good. Um, we didn't really face um, too many cupcakes, and you'll see, um, you'll see that in a minute. This is just kind of going through all of the leaderboard I think there were just a few dogs nothing too crazy though up in masters which was you know a little surprising because you um, typically expect to see some docs happening um, but I don't know maybe everybody played clean this this time around or maybe kabam didn't didn't uh, do too much into to looking at um, people cheating but regardless this is just showing um, the leaderboard all the way through Platinum 3, I believe, which is the top 300 alliances. So again, congrats to TCN, GT40, and JA for getting the podium. Um, and then we're going to go and open up the um, Nexuses. You can see I have enough to get two rank 4s and... I have already done those rank fours. If you've seen my videos, I ended up taking uh, Gallon and um, Quicksilver up, and I got them through the featured. And so, with these mutants, I'm hoping for Archangel or a good awakening on some of the champs that I have. We get a storm, and then we pick a bishop. Not exactly what I was looking for. Bishop is great. Awakening on storm, eh? Still, still searching for AA, but spoiler alert, I did get AA through the feature. And then here is the, how the end of the season played out. Our last six wars were against 1NG and Matrix. We beat them, and then we went on a three-loss losing streak. Lost to Salty, New Nation, and PYCB. PYCB, we beat them earlier in the season. We played not well. We lost to them, and then we needed to secure a win to get masters in the last war and we were up against HCX and we played awesome. Um, we got some donuts in there and we finished out. So here's just kind of the overall stats. If you want to look at how our season played out, we ended up going six and six, which is enough to get into masters generally. And then as far as myself, um, I had 85 fights. I had one death to a maw early on in the season which was totally my fault. I shouldn't have died to him, but I just absolutely played terrible, played it the worst possible. Um, and 85 fights for the Alliance, it actually was the most amount of fights. Um, and it was, it's just kind of interesting because of how everything played out because last season 
I only have 52 fights. Um, so a, a significant increase in the load, which I'm totally fine with. Um, and I just felt like the assignments that I was given worked out really well, um, obviously, um, since I didn't die um, only but one time. And I put a lot of work in with Thing and Torch. Those two put in a lot of work. And um, yeah, so I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. Missed, missed the Deathless season, but you know, we can always try for next, which is fine. But um, yeah, so we ended up getting Masters. Got some decent rewards. We're gonna try for Masters again and uh, see how it rolls out. I just want to give thanks to everybody in my alliance, especially um, our leader Demps and all the officers. Um, put in a lot of time and effort to make to make these war seasons happen and try to be as successful as possible. Appreciate everybody. Um, and we'll just wrap it up with that. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.